Hi everyone, I just want to show you today this little two tables that I have here on my west window in my living room. And the lighting is going to be very weird here, I can already tell. But here I have some African violets. And they love it here, they have bloomed so much for me. This one's a new bloom and then I think it might stop for a while. These are dying off and I don't see any new buds now, so it might um, stop blooming for a while, get some more energy and start reblooming. It did very pretty, it grew a lot, and this was a rescue. And this one just stopped blooming, beautiful white. And this one, I love the foliage. It bloomed a lot of these pink color with some little purple spots. Y'all saw that on my other video, my African violets. Right here I have this little Tulumnia. Right here. And that right there is a new growth. That, that one right there is a new growth. The roots are doing good. I have an sphagnum moss. Um, not too tight just you know kind of there and it's 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 little so I, I don't expect it to bloom anytime soon this is um cat leia i got an orchid sale about a month ago from sunset valley orchids and it's this And I bought it in bud, in spike in bud, and it's beautiful. I loved, I got it because I love the suitables. Look how fat that is. It has this new growth and it's growing awesome. When I got it, it was tiny. And now it's growing big. The suitable is fat and chunky. These suitables. Are nice and healthy the roots look good I don't know what they look like inside I haven't unpotted it leaves are nice and green and firm oh see here he goes he just dropped my telonia really gosh <laughs> you're nothing but trouble <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so this is my little, that little cat lay. I want to show you the blooms. It doesn't smell. But look at that color. And they're, they're tiny. This is like a compact uh, cat um, It's It's not big. It's, it's small, but look at it. Close up. Ooh. Wow. Beautiful. Wow. I'm sorry guys, I'm just staring at it like this so much because it looks so beautiful. Wow. I'm just in awe. <laughs> I haven't even looked at it that closely like I am now that I'm sharing with y'all. This is that one of those divisions from that big huge cat Leia. This is also an orange color. And I got this in about a year ago. And it's this right here. Pot. I made a video on this. Two videos probably. And so it's doing good. It has I have it in bark and sphagnum moss and it has really good roots in there. See can you see them? Really good roots. And it has uh, this new growth right here. And it's, it's getting kind of big. I don't see any roots down here, but the roots are just growing. They're right there on the top and they're going to go down. Hopefully they go down. But I have it right there. That's all I have on the table. On the windowsill, I have the cat Leia my sister gave brought to me from uh, Hawaii, if y'all remember the video. And it's just 
there it's just doing okay it's doing good it's getting used to everything this is my Encyclia Boricana from Wade's Orchids and it's doing really good it's growing a nice root it's my favorite root <laughs> you even have favorite roots do you have favorite roots am I the only weird one I don't think so <laughs> look at those roots it's very nice and the pseudobulbs are nice and chunky tight they're really um, healthy really um, strong I guess or firm I don't know how to say it I don't see any spikes at all but it's okay because it's healthy and I have a feeling that if it's healthy it'll bloom eventually it's just taking its sweet time but that's what I have here on my west window guys I hope you liked everything that I showed you bye